What's up guys, it's Jay, back with another one. And today, I'm gonna be teaching you how to roll your own blunt. Let's get started. <laughs> no, for real though. Today I'm gonna be teaching, did you stop? Oh no, you didn't, all right, my bad. Hey, today I'm gonna be teaching you how to roll the fucking blunt, no fucking jokes, all jokes aside, all seriousness included. First thing you're gonna do, I mean, I got my fucking beer right here, I got my fucking pack right here. Whatever wraps that you like to use, go ahead and get those. I like Dutch Master Palmas. The best until the end. Dumbass. And we got some fucking pack. I don't know if you want to show it in here real quick. Bust a couple pieces out. I got some UK cheese. I don't know how fat I want to roll this motherfucking thing. Fuck it. That looks like enough. So, here we go. You got the pack. The wrap. Flour. Is there enough light? Should I turn another light on? Which light? I don't know. Is it's it good? good. Is it liquid? Yeah, okay. it's fine. I'm gonna crack my beer real quick. And then we'll get started. Okay. First things first, you have your bum. You gotta break it down. Personally, I do not like grinders. I don't own a grinder. Just because, I mean... Back in the old Woodstock days, how the fuck did they roll joints, right? With their bare fucking hands. And that's what I've always done. I don't even... I honestly don't even own a grinder. But I would... The only time I would use a grinder, though, is if I was rolling joints. And... Which is fucking slim. Because I, I don't smoke. I, I don't smoke joints like that. Unless they're pre-rolled from the dispensary. Because then I don't have to do none of the work. So you're just going to break down your bud. I mean, if you do have a grinder, I mean... By all fucking means, go ahead and use it. All you gotta do is break it down. I don't give a fuck if you use a fucking your fingers, a fucking scissor, I don't know. Whatever the fuck you could think that can cut some fucking butt up and get it done. However you get it done. And I mean, I was gonna say like, oh, you should roll this much in a blunt, like weight wise. I'm not gonna tell you in a fucking weight, because I don't I'm not gonna tell you a weight that should be rolled in a blunt. You could fucking see some nugs and know if you should, if you can roll a blunt with that or not. Over time, I guess you'll know that. But, um, yeah, when I first, when I started for, oh shit, when I first started rolling blunts, my shits were fucking shitty. I used to fucking, I just, I was so bad and I didn't really learn until I was probably like, probably like 15, 16 years old, is when I actually started to roll them, but I didn't fucking, I was not purling them whatsoever. <laughs> them shits are fucking trash bags. Shits were a fucking tra piece of trash blank. But, uh, yeah, over time, practice makes perfect, and that'll fucking get you. Uh, no, I need a little more. I'm gonna get this one a little fatter. I want to smoke this one later, after this video, matter of fact. I'm going to go fucking smoke it. Oh, fuck, man, I'm getting scared. Oh, man. All right, so we got it broken down, guys. Oh, uh, that looks like a fuck enough to me. So, I'm going to put this back in here. Shut up, lady, shut up. Excuse me, guys. That's <laughs> I'm sorry. That's my dog, lady. She is fucking annoying. She is fucking annoying. I'm sorry I said that to her. Shut up! I'll throw these fucking stems out real quick. Now, oh shit. Now your butt is broken down, and it is all fucking screw, screw, screw. It's looking good, right? All right. Now we have the Dutchess. You gotta fucking go ahead and crack the Dutch and fucking, oh, go ahead and crack it and fucking gut it. I'm not going to show you how to gut a fucking Dutch on video. You should know how to gut a Dutch. Because I, I don't know, should you show me gutting it? Yeah. Fuck it, I'll do it right here. I'll do it in this box. Sorry, it's pretty dirty. She's just going to get your wrap. Find the fucking, see Dutches have like these veins in them. I kind of like stay and clear of them. And fucking, you're just going to want to. Split that shit right down the middle. Use your uh, index fingers and your damn thumbs. Press down. Fendi! Fendi! Alright, my cat was by the weed. Sorry, guys. Excuse me. 
He jumped up. I didn't want him to fuck it up. Beat his ass. Just want to dump all that fucking shit out. And we'll come back over here. I blow on my shit. I kind of do that. Kind of, uh... I don't know what the point of that is, actually. Oh, to, like, make it more, like, moist, I guess. Like, damp. I don't know. Bring some humidity to the blunt. Rap. Sounds about right. Alright, guys. So this... I know people who fucking, like, lick the fucking rap. The rap would be like... They'd be like... Mah, mah, mah. Nah. No, I, I can't do it. Keep it simple. Just like this. Alright, so now we got the bud. So, when you're rolling the blunt, the reason I like rolling blunts so much is because you can manipulate the blunt way more than you could a joint. Because it's like a tobacco leaf. But, I personally like to leave a little nug right here. And I, and I use, and when I roll blunts, I roll them from the right to the left. So the right would be where my mouthpiece is. So I'm going to hit the blunt from this side. I leave a little nug just for like kind of like a filter, I guess you would say, but it's not a filter just to like give you a stopping point of when you're putting your other butt in there. You can see where uh, it's all at and shit. So you're going to want to put your bud into your blunt as much as you can. I know you're probably going to have some fallout. You know what? You're going to have shit fall out a lot. So get a fucking nice first. Once you get a lot in there, go ahead. Hold the blunt from the right side. That's what I do. And I just go ahead and, and work it with my left index finger and just pack it down and kind of like make it all fucking even. And uh, yeah, once you get it more even, you can go ahead and add more in there. Oh, that's a fat stem. Ah, you about to fucking slip by me, huh? I got him. All right, so it's all nice and fucking whatever. And I don't really roll my weed down all the way to the end too. You see how my fingers in here, my right finger is kind of like in the end of the blunt like that. I kind of like leave a little space for just a little space because I don't like rolling the weed all the way down to the end because then when you start getting the fucking like on a rosin or resin, whatever the fuck it's called on there. Yeah, fuck that. So I'm starting from the right side. What I'm basic, what I'm gonna do, is I'm just gonna tuck it and roll it. I know that sounds fucking like what the fuck, but I'm about to show you. Fuck that. All right, fuck these little. All right. All I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna wanna get this weed and just push it, push it down. But as you're pushing it down, your other fingers, your index fingers, are kind of holding this part right here. Your thumbs are what's doing the work, really. So now I push that part down. And as you can see, it's gonna just, you're gonna just push it down and you're gonna work your way all the way down until um, you, you're done like tucking it. But you're just gonna keep doing this all the way until you get down to the end. So right there, you can see that I have pushed it in. And I'm, as I'm pushing it, I'm folding it and I'm just, it's really, you're just pushing it. I don't want to say you're rolling it because I'm not really rolling anything. If you look at my fingers, on my pointer fingers, or my index fingers are on top, kind of giving me like a back fucking board, I guess, back rest. And then my thumbs are just doing the work. I'm taking this side of the wrap where my thumbs are and I'm just fucking taking this and making sure I'm pushing all the weed down that's right there. So whatever weed that's right there is just getting pushed down. That's really it. I don't like the tuck and roll fucking shit. I don't know. I mean, yeah, you roll it. This counts as fucking rolling it. But to dumb it down, you're literally just pressing down the weed to make sure you can fucking roll it when it's time to lick it and shit. So I'm still going all the way down to the end. I got some fucking fallen brothers right here. I'm about to put them in. And you're always going to have shit fall out too. You can't have the fucking most perfect, perfect blunt, but you can get close to it. Done, man. I'm gonna leave all this shit. No, no, I'll try to get some in there. Try to get some of that in there. 
All right. So once you got that part done and you're nice and fucking tucked and all that shit, you're going to get to this stage right here. So this is the stage after you're done tucking and rolling. You see all the, this upper lip right here where my, where you were basically tucking the uh, weed into. <clears throat> There's a space now, excuse me. There's a space now, so you can't really see the weed. And that's like your main objective. You're, when you're packing that weed down with your thumbs, that's exactly what you're doing. You're packing it down. So the weed's more stationary now that it's in here than it was when I first fucking did that and put it in there. So this is the easy part now to me. So all you're going to do now is you're going to lick this part of the butt right here, <laughs> this right, this part right here, and you're just going to lick it and just fold it over. So I licked it. You don't want to get it fucking soaking, but you know, wet enough to stick. And then once it's wet, all you have to do is just use your upper lip and bring that bitch down. And if it keeps coming up, lick it again. Use that upper lip and bring it down. That upper lip. This fucking shit came off. It's all good. So, yeah. So now you can see where what it's starting to look like now. See, this is stuck. So the blunt's starting to fucking become a blunt now. And you're just going to keep doing that. Once you've tucked it and done all that, you can keep tucking it to help you fucking lick it and roll it. You don't, like I said again, you don't want to get the blunt fucking soaked and fucking slobber and soaked. You don't want to do that. Fucking, you could do it twice. You could do it a couple times. It don't matter. As long as the blunt fucking sticks, that's all that matters. So then, you're just going to keep licking it, fold it over, and that's it. Some people burn it, fucking toast it up and shit. I don't, because I put that shit right back in my Dutch pack. It's going to be fresh as hell anyways. But that's it, guys. I mean, you can get a tool and poke some of your butt down, but that's it. That's about as clean as I can motherfucking get it <laughs> right now. For you guys but i hope that helped anybody that doesn't know how to roll if i taught you something today go ahead and leave a fucking thumbs up on that shit if you didn't know how to roll before and practice makes perfect like all good all things practice makes perfect to get good at it when i first rolled in my first blunt it did not look like that it looked like a fucking broken branch off a tree that you would find in your backyard on some real shit but i think that was day 15, I think. 15, I believe. Or 14. Or 14. 15, 15 or 14. Know. But this is the video of me teaching you how to roll a blunt. I hope you guys stay safe. And yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.